Hey everyone, welcome to the Crypto ZX channel. If you're new, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. But now, let's get right into today's topic, which is regarding and none other than Polygon Matic. We're going to be doing our daily analysis on the price of Matic, see what is happening, and where we could see the price going in the immediate short term. As you guys can see right now, as of June 15th, 2023, we have seen the price of Matic fall once again, about 6% in all Bitcoin, Ethereum, and USD comparative over over the last 24 hours if we're looking at the price currently sitting at 58.7 cents you guys can see the market cap is currently sitting at 5.5 billion dollars and the 24 hour trading volume currently sitting at 559.4 million dollars so what exactly is going on what is affecting the price of matic to you know drop down this sharply for a project with a massive massive community are and are we about to see lower prices right now and am i worried so let's get right into it before we get into the charts guys i just want to say the good old disclaimer anything on this channel is not financial advice always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in crypto so look what has happened today i'm going to show you guys the hourly time frame so we get a better understanding as to what really happened so of course course at this point you know it's no secret we all know what happened just back on june 10th you know we saw the price of matic fall below this very crucial level of support at 73 cents we saw a drop of about um you know almost 30 percent after we lost that support but since then this is what you guys need to keep in mind look how you know fast this bounce back was back into the 78.6 we saw in two days the price of matic bounced 32.7 percent and that shows the level of interest this project has the amount of people that are interested in this project when it comes to uh you know retail interest as well as institutions so now comes the question what is next of course today we once again saw a pretty sharp decline within the price of uh you know matic you know if you were holding it yesterday at 66 cents right below that 78.6 zone you know the price has dropped about 15 percent since then but that is organic let me tell you something btc dominance right now is literally sky high bitcoin did go down this morning at twenty four thousand seven hundred dollar mark which of course impacted the price of the entire altcoin market and remember matic is called a security by the sec and right now that is affecting the price even more but the question of the hour is are we about to retest that june 10th low that we have set for ourselves at 51 cents that's an, a drop of 13 percent from current levels as of now is that a possibility of course you know we could see the price of matic fall down to that level once again only reason i why i say that is because bitcoin is still on the uncertainty level you know there's still a lot of people thinking that bitcoin could drop below to 24,000 even possibly $22,000 mark if it were to fall down to $22,000 mark i've told you guys in my recent videos you know that still puts the price of bitcoin in an upwards trajectory reason being uh you know that would set uh bitcoin still for a you know higher high higher low higher high higher low so we we're still in an upwards pattern but you know main target that i would be looking for if we lose this support line uh would be as twenty four thousand dollar bitcoin so if that were to happen then yes there is a chance for the price of matic to fall back down to 51 cents or possibly even go lower than that yes no one wants to hear this but there are signs that are right in front of us right now last time btc dominance was this high was may 2021 you can see this for yourself may 2021 was the last time you know the dominance was this high and that was when we were in a bull market and you know that was when dominance was falling down not going up it was falling down and um, you know that's where the altcoin season was going crazy but now what we're seeing happening uh with is you know we're seeing so much money flowing into bitcoin and not just from retail look what is happening so you know crypto skull came up with uh you know such a great uh, thread and you know he uh, posted something that i totally agree with and i'm going to share this with you so shout out to crypto skull he says something doesn't add up the sec suing everything uh black rock 
buying massive amounts of crypto during the FUD period. BlackRock announces filing a Bitcoin ETF using Coinbase. And look, Hong Kong putting pressure on banks to take crypto clients. So something massive is coming. I'm talking the biggest bull market. One must be really foolish not accumulating massive here when the biggest asset manager of the world is be smart fam. So I really like this take. At the end of the day, everyone is speculating. This guy is speculating. I'm speculating. But, you know, the signs are definitely there. You know, we've been through so much fun, especially if you're a crypto OG. You know, if you're new to Matic, you know, this might be. Uh, you know a scary time for you but the og matic investors know this is peanuts this is peanuts as to what we have seen if you've been on my channel for a long long time you know i've shared a very very interesting story i know one of the biggest matic whales personally and you know he or she uh, are my very very good friend and let me tell you they are a multi-millionaire, uh, you know, investor in Matic. And again, they did not invest millions. They invested a really, really uh, decent amount, um, less than six figures uh, back uh, in 2018 around the IEO days. And there was a time there was manipulation that occurred in futures trading for Matic. And, you know, these people that I'm talking about, I'm not going to tell you anything if it's a he or she, but they invested a lot of money at that time like again less than six figures and retired last bull cycle and guess what they were doing there so when that manipulation occurred back in 2018 to 2019 i don't i don't remember exactly what year it was uh but it was one of those years when um there was a massive manipulation matic fell down 60 percent 60 or to 65 percent in a single day and no one wanted polygon and you guess what the price was? Below a penny. You've heard that correct. It was below one cent. It was like 0 0.003 or something like that. And now, fast forward to uh, three, four years, 60 cents. And all time high was $3. And what else am I trying to tell you? The expansion of Polygon has gone through the roof. That time it wasn't even called Polygon. It was called Matic Network. All the OGs remember. So basically what I'm trying to say is FUD is always there. Do I believe Matic is over? Absolutely not. I might think it's going to overcome the SEC um, you know, situation. Absolutely. SEC can't just go and say everything is a security. And it's more than just the SEC. They've just labeled it. It's not that they're saying, you know, we're suing Matic, we're suing Cardano, we're suing Solana. If that happens, yes, we could be seeing more downward trend. That is no secret at this point. I'm not going to sit here and say that's not the case. That will happen. But I think we will overcome this massive but, and, you know, massive thing that's coming up on our hand. But like I said, you know, the questions that I've been getting, is there a possibility that we could fall back down to 51 cents? And the answer is yes. And the only reason I say that is because Bitcoin could still go down to 24K mark. That level is still on the table because we're not in the 61.8. And of course, you know, all this uh, news needs to be taken into consideration when we're analyzing the charts. But that is it for today's update. Of course, we'll keep you guys updated if anything were to happen. Love you all. See you tomorrow. I've been Crypto ZX and peace.